Johnson to Ron Jameer Kamado pace car. The sun is just about set, and that is the perfect setting for feature racing here on the High Banks of the New Smyrna Speedway. Ladies and gentlemen, Daytona Dodge American Auto Pace Car begins to accelerate. Field in the hands of Dylan LeBose, number 16. 50 green flag laps. Here they come. Looking for green off corner number four. And they've got it. Sunday Night Racing Series Number 1. And on the outside, 93 plays Hatchnecker.
on all restarts. So Earl Beckner, your leader, the green 71, up on the outside of the blue 2H machine for Matt Jarrett. The Daytona Dodge American Auto Pace Car begins to accelerate and pull off the speedway. 25 laps to go now. They took that over lap off, so exactly halfway through the green flag. And we're ready to go. In control of our restart. How about Dylan LeBeau taking the third spot? Here comes Ken Copley.
Lesson. He's, ladies and gentlemen, here he comes. Make some noise for Earl Beckner Jr., your race winner. <laughs> Earl's got some friends here that are coming down Victory Lane to share this moment with him. He's going. Timmy Walters down here. Timmy's been helping out Earl and vice versa, trying to get Timmy back on track. Earl Beckner. Boy, that was a dominating performance. I'm sure you didn't want that caution right around the halfway point because you know the 2-H is fast, but you had them all covered tonight, my friend. Yeah, I really don't care. I, I, I'd rather race them than run away with it. Uh, you know, I'm not racing for the points, you know. It's, uh, I'm, here to have, I'm here to win, and that's what I come out here to do is win. Uh, it car counts down tonight, but, you know, it still was a good night. And, you know, and, uh, anybody looking for a real good race car, <laughs> I got one. I'm surprised nobody's taken that offer yet because this is a race winning car. Obviously, you've got a number of wins in this and the sportsman. So, fans, if you're trying to get out here, talk to this man. He'll sell you a real good race car. But, Earl, like I said, just a dominating performance tonight. You're out here to win and you continue to do just that. Yeah, we're going to come out next week and run the sportsman. Hopefully, we can double down with that deal again, too. And uh, kudos to Matt. You know, they, they really worked hard. I mean, Last year I ran away with everything, you know, and he's he's keeping me in check and he's following my tire tracks now. So a little bit more time with him, I'm sure he'll be, you know, a lot more aggressive. You know, he got him win last time, and uh, you know, hats off to him on that. And uh, you know, he had the better car. You know, you don't always have the best car. Really, you got a lot of people down here with you tonight. Who's with you? Uh, we brought the church with us, the Brazilian church, Portuguese. Yeah, yeah. Uh, this is my daughter, my daughter's family. She's. Uh, and, uh, and, uh, and uh, I'm, I'm real proud of them, and they're, they're a great, great family. And any of you uh, Portuguese people who need a good church to go to, come on over. Well, congratulations again. We'll let you celebrate. Ladies and gentlemen, give it up for Earl Beckner Jr. You're wearing the E-Mod 50. And Matt's coming over to show the sportsmanship. We'll let all these people get in here, get some pictures. We'll talk to Matt over here by his car. Matt, I'm sure it's... Uh, not the result you were looking for tonight. You got that caution about halfway through. Get caught up with him, but looks like he just had you guys covered. But you've been about the only guy that can get up there and give him anything this year. Oh, it's hard. He keeps us on our toes. I mean, I love when he's here. It, it, it gives us a good challenge, and hope he comes back again. I mean, but the car was good. It got looser and looser as the run went on. That caution came out, and I don't know if someone was dumping oil on the track or something, but he was getting loose, and I was sideways. So, But it is what it is. I mean, we'll come back in a couple weeks and see if we can get one spot better. This will just make you guys go back to the shop and work even harder, won't it? Oh, yeah. I, got, I can't thank my stepdad enough. He... He put so much money in this thing for me to let me come out and do this and have fun. Uh, Ricky Wood, Lee Folk Racing, my dad, uh, my brother Scott, um, my girlfriend, my three kids, and congratulations on the first on your first. Um, and Uncle Shaw, my spotter. Uh, oh yeah, it's we're getting there. We're gonna get it again. Matt, I'm sure we'll see you in Victory Lane again this year. Ladies and gentlemen, coming up for Matt Jarrett, coming home in second place today with a great run. 
And how about this, a career best finish, first time up on the podium for the young up and coming driver, Dylan LeBeau. Congratulations, my friend, great run for you. Third place, those two guys, like I said, they've been the class of the field all year. And here you are, third place on the podium. Just need a little bit more to get up with those guys, but this has got to feel great to uh, get your career best finish tonight in the 50 lapper. Yeah, yeah, it feels awesome. Those guys, are, they're no joke, but without my sponsors, Daytona State Jewelry and Swipe Out Cleaning Service, this wouldn't be possible. My dad, all my family, sorry. Hey, man, that's, that's what it's all about. This is all about family, man. Enjoy this moment. It's great to see a new face up here. You've come a long way in the trucks, and now this EMOD, I mean, I'd like to see your dad get back out here and race with him one of these days. But, man, congratulations on a fantastic run tonight. Thank you. It's, it's a team effort for sure. Without it, everyone behind me, it's going to be possible. So it's awesome. Enjoy, man. Go celebrate. Ladies and gentlemen, for Dylan the ball, career best, third place run. Here comes Dad to give him a bath. Give him a big old hug, man. There you go. Family moment down here at Victory Lane. That's what we like to see. Congratulations to Dylan. An emotional third place run. I don't blame him. Those guys have been around here for a long time. Now we're getting the new generation of Lobos. Look for good things out of Dylan.